Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm going to be filming an Amazon haul. I'm super excited. I've literally been buying a lot of tons of stuff. And so this last time I bought, um, I got a whole bunch of packages at once. So I thought I would go ahead and do an Amazon haul. Um, a lot of it's like stuff that I've seen like TikTok, like you must have from Amazon or even on YouTube, I've seen videos. I've literally been like shopping non-stop so I thought I would go ahead and film what I got so if you guys like these types of videos please don't forget to like and subscribe and yeah so let's just go ahead and jump right into the video okay so the first package is this box so let's see and don't mind me I'm literally like in my super comfy like nursery chair or like rocking chair that we got for the nursery thought it would be since it's just a sit down ow it's just a sit down video I thought um this is fine so okay Good. Ooh, this actually has a lot of stuff in it so as you can tell so let's go ahead and start with the first one okay oh so this is a candle wick trimmer you guys so I got this uh because I thought it was super interesting it had really good reviews and I didn't even realize that this existed, along with a lot of the stuff on YouTube that I got. I mean, on YouTube, <laughs> along with a lot of the stuff on Amazon that I purchased. Okay, so this one is supposed to be something to trim your wicks on your candles, uh, obviously. <laughs> so this is what it looks like. Um, so I really like candles. Um, and it kind of, it's so annoying, like, having to take the scissors and, like, try to get in there and cut them. Obviously, when you buy candles, it says on there to um, trim the wicks evenly, um, just for your candle to last longer. But also, I think it's because it'll, like, uh, if you've already burned it and you try to burn it again, obviously, like, the, the flames are already, like, all burnt up. So, that will create, like, smoke and make your house dirty. So, I think that's why you're also supposed to do it. Um, but also, it's just better for, like, the life of your candle if that makes sense anyway okay so I got this it's like super awkward but I actually brought a candle because I knew this was in the box so I brought a candle to kind of test it out and then I have it right here so this is my candle this is one of my favorites from Bath and Body Works it's fresh ball song so let's see also I sound out of breath just because I probably am because I'm so freaking big now but anyway so that's that let's see how easy it is Oh yeah, well, I guess, I don't know what camera to show you, but, oh yeah, super easy. Oh, I think I almost broke that one, okay. Okay, so I w trimmed them, but I actually kind of did it uneven. But yeah, it's kind of handy, and then the actual, like, wick stays here, so you can just toss this out, which, I'm just going to throw it in here, because I'm taking this out anyway, but, yeah, that was pretty easy. These are kind of, like, very awkward. I guess they have to be that way in order for this to be, like straight but anyway that is that and then I also got this it says barbecue lighter so you can actually use this for candles or as a lighter which I thought was super interesting this is one of those things that was like all over TikTok I think and I've seen videos of tons of videos of like you must have because this is like really cool um and I wish I would have had this earlier I literally, we have like just like those long lighter, light, lighters or whatever. Um, and we use that for our like gender reveal. We didn't really have a gender reveal, but it was just for us, like for me and the kids. Um, how am I going to open this? I need scissors. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, and it was so annoying because it was so freaking windy and we could hardly even like get them lit up and it was so annoying. And anyway, for those of you that don't know and don't follow me on Instagram, I am having a baby girl, which we're super excited, hence why the room is pink. Obviously, you probably guessed it. Um, but yeah, make sure you follow me on Instagram if you're not already. And okay, we're about this. It's taking way too long. Okay, so this is what it looks like. Um, and then you can bend this. So, and you can charge it, which I thought was really cool because of the fact that obviously, anyway, so I thought it was really cool that you can charge it. That way you're not like wasting on lighters like over and over again. So I thought that was cool. I'm not sure that if it has any power right now. Oh, I guess it does because these little blue lights came on. I don't know if you guys can see them. Oh shit, yeah. So that's really cool. I guess it's just, 
I don't know if you guys are able to see that. So let's see. A little scared. I have to like. What the hell? Hello? Oh yeah. Okay, cool. I was like not doing it right, but yeah. That was really easy. <laughs> anyway. Okay, cool. Yeah. So you just, you turn it off or just kidding. You turn it off. You turn it on, and I guess when all the lights are on, I'm assuming this is like for you to know like if it's charged or not. So you press the power and it turns on. So I'm just gonna do that because I don't really actually want to light anything. I probably should have. I don't know where my lid's at, but normally I would have just closed it so that way the smoke doesn't get everywhere. But yeah, that's super interesting. Okay, moving on. Okay, so next. What else did I get? Oh, I also got these clips for my hair. So these are like supposed to be, I mean, I should have gone so long as time ago, but these are supposed to be so your hair doesn't bend when you're like working on your hair or maybe you're straightening it out or you're trying to do like a look. So this is so that it doesn't show like bend marks in your, bend marks in your hair. So I'm really interested to try these on. Um, and I will, oh, also I will, I will try to go ahead and list everything in the bottom bar, in the description bar, in case you guys are interested. So this is a 12 piece, and it comes with black, pink, and white ones. Um, so, yeah. I guess if my hair was down, I would have, like, put one in there, but it's not, so I can't really try it on. So, anyway, I did get those. I also got, oh, this is not really that exciting. This is just some breast milk storage bags, <laughs> because I am going to try to breastfeed. And next, oh, okay, so I'm super excited about this one. This is a lint remover. So I didn't even know that this existed. And uh, basically, it actually, I, I kind of want to try it out, but I don't really have anything to use here at the moment. So this basically, you know when you wear like pants that you really like, yoga pants, cotton pants that um when you wear them for a while like they'll have like little fuzzies or maybe even like shirts you know like if you just wash them too much or you use them because you really like them or let's say like around your butt like your crotch area they rub against each other so it'll like have all these fuzzies supposedly this will literally like just chop it off like obviously you're not trying to like cut your freaking pants but like it'll just take off those little pieces that are extra annoying and it'll like suck them in here and then you just empty this out so I thought that was super interesting. I need to get, I probably need batteries for this. Mm, yeah, I need batteries to try it out. What the, I don't know what this is. I guess this is to clean it. Anyway, so yeah, I guess once I have batteries in there, then I will turn it on. And you basically, I'm not obviously gonna, well, there's no batteries in there. But basically, yeah, you would just press it against and this little, it has like a little fan in here or like some kind of blade. I'm not sure if you can see it. So I guess that will kind of just spin around and it literally just chops off all those little like lints or little balls. And yeah. So yeah, that's that. I'm excited to try this out. And I think that's it for this box. So let's go ahead and move on. Oh, okay. I did want to mention these things. I actually already, I had gotten these items like late last week. So I thought I would just include them. One of the items is the scalp massager, which I have seen a couple of people on YouTube mention this one. And I was very intrigued because I want, I, I have been looking for something for my scalp because I don't know, my scalp sometimes just tends to get really tender, if that makes sense. So like, I like to massage it in the shower, but especially with my nails, sometimes I feel like my nails are stabbing my scalp and then sometimes I feel like I don't have enough when I don't have nails. Like, it's not enough for me to like really get in there. I don't know how to explain it. So I thought this was perfect when I saw it online I was like huh so I ordered it so I've tried it once and I really really like it because it's not super heavy for some reason I imagine this being like kind of heavy um, which I like was thinking like obviously you're like you have your hand up and it's heavy on your hand you're like gonna get tired like pretty quickly but it's actually not it's kind of like hollow inside so it's not super heavy um, these are not like super sharp to where it's gonna hurt I like the little grooves here for your fingers, like they fit perfectly, and it's actually just really comfortable. So the next thing are these little brushes. So these are kind of like what you see at the salon sometimes. I got these for my nails uh, because you know you get a lot of dirt under them, and I saw these. I think I saw these on like a Jaclyn Hill video, um, but I've actually been wanting to get them. So like I saw her like 
put them in her video. And I'm like, you know what? I'm actually one of those. So, uh, I don't think these are the exact ones she tagged because I found some that were cheaper and actually came with the fifth brush. I think the ones that she linked were like four of them. So, I found these. But anyway, um, so it's just something that you can put here and you just clean under your nails. And I thought that was really good, especially right now. I was actually really hesitant on getting my nails done, which, by the way, um, I didn't go to salon. The girl that I've actually I'm going to salon in a really long time, like probably a couple of a few years already. Um, it's just like a one on one. I just go to her house, and she we're obviously wearing masks, and she actually has this like plastic thing barrier between us. So I thought it was safe. I felt like it was safe enough for me to go. So um, anyway, but another reason why I was hesitant to go was because. I really don't want like dirt accumul accumulating under my nails, but I thought this was super helpful. Then again, I'm also not like really going outside of my house to be getting a lot of nasty dirt, but you never know. So yeah, I thought these were really handy. Also, you don't have to necessarily use these for like your nails, like your hands. You can use them for your toes too. If you're trying to give yourself a pedicure, I don't know. Um, okay, so moving on. I also got these chargers. I think I actually also saw these. Did I see this in her video? Or not. I saw this somewhere, but um, these are just really long chargers. So this comes with three, and I actually got I already I already got it out because my charger broke, and I was looking for one online anyway. So I got this one. This is how long it is, and like I said, I already used this. So I already connected it. So this is really long. They are eight feet. How long are these? I can't quite remember how many feet long they are, but they're really long. And since obviously I'm delivering soon, a lot of like I've been watching YouTube is like what to take like to your for your hospital bag, which I've had two kids already, but my son is already eight. He'll be like eight and a half by the time I actually have his baby. So I was just been wanting to get like you know freshen up and kind of remember what I should bring. I obviously need to bring a charger, but one of the tips that I saw a lot was like make sure you bring a long charging cord because obviously you're in the bed and depending on where the outlet's at, you might not actually be able to have your phone with you. So depending on how long my labor is, if I want to use my phone, I thought this would come in handy, so that's why I got it. Um, but also because I do actually freaking hate the cord that comes with the Apple charger. They're freaking short and it's freaking annoying. And I thought this was perfect. So I also got these. Next. Oh my goodness, so much breath. Okay. So another thing that I got, this is like baby related, is this infant feeding support pillow or cushion I guess um it's by itsy ritzy they have like those little cute pacifiers and I thought it was really interesting I had really really good reviews as well all the stuff that I got had obviously really good reviews I always look at those first before I purchase but um I liked it because it's gray so it's kind of neutral and I can also obviously use it if I'm like nursing but also like if I just like to pump and the kids or I want to give the baby a bottle they can also use it to kind of help support uh, which I think will come in handy because a lot of times you do need like a pillow or something because your arm gets tired or even sometimes just like holding the baby. So I thought this was really cool. And yeah, I saw really good reviews. I saw a couple of people recommend it um, on their videos. So that's why I got that. And moving on, I think I'm almost done. Let me open this package. Oh, okay. This one is actually baby related as well. So this I got because my sister also has a baby girl and um, she gave me tons of bows. And I've actually I bought some to myself. So I have like a ton of them. And I was trying to find like the best way to organize them um, because I don't just want to dump them like in a little basket and then just like dig through them. I really want to be able to see like all of them so that way I can coordinate the baby's outfits. So I got this and it's especially for like headbands and bows. And I thought it was really cute. I kind of want to maybe put it inside the closet or something. But still where it's visible. I might even just hang it on the wall depending if it doesn't fit in there. But yeah, so basically I can like detach this stuff. Let me see. I don't want to break it. Yeah. So I can take this out. Thank you. Donna's in here. So she's like helping me. She hands me a bow. Or a, a headband. So I guess technically I can like put it in here like this. And I can put like multiple of them. And then hang them up. So yeah, I think you just put it in this way. And then you can hang them out through here. If you want them like just... To hang across the four you can but I'm gonna put like separate ones in each one and then um, you can also do that here these are things more for individual I guess if you have like really thin ones that I can just put a whole bunch here and then just clip this so it has a lot of space I hope they fit on here um, 
But yeah, I got this for that reason. So this is the last package. Let's see. I'm trying to remember what this is. Oh. This is also baby related. I guess I left all the baby stuff to the end. So this is like a really cute, they're called baby elephant ears. Again, these were also like really recommended in a lot of the videos that I saw. So basically you just put like baby right here, obviously just like that. And it's like for head support. You can put it like on their car seat or in their bouncer, um, pretty much anywhere. You can just set this down and it just helps for their head. That way it doesn't like lean to one side. Obviously when they're newborn, it's uh, they don't have that much head support. So it had really, really good reviews and I was excited. I wasn't so excited about the print, but literally all the prints were sold out. Like literally it was, this is the only like girly one. And even then I wouldn't mind like a neutral, but even those were all sold out. So yeah, I also am super excited to use this for the baby. All right guys, that is it for this haul. Thank you so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed it, again, please don't forget to like and subscribe. And if there's anything in here that you guys already have that you love, let me know. Um, but like I said, a lot of the stuff that I got were either like TikTok made me buy or like on YouTube or they were recommended on YouTube videos that I saw. So, um, again, I will go ahead and try to list everything in the bottom bar if you guys want to look at it for yourself. If there's any recommendations that you guys have of stuff that you try from Amazon that I have to try, let me know in the comments, um, so I can take a look. And yeah, that's pretty much it, you guys. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye.